festive new Christmas papers, gilded accents, and design tapes from Tim Holtz. And boy, do they all go together well. It looks really great all together. We're going to start with these double-sided papers. So I'm going to put these aside for the moment. So from the ideology line, this is the paper stash that is 8 inches by 8 inches. It's going to be glued up at the top, nice little pad. And we are going to get into 24 sheets of double-sided papers. So there are two of each of the designs that you see, and they are double-sided. So just some really fun Tim Holtz style designs, really kind of vintage and classic, some of them, and uh, just beautiful imagery that's going to match. So here's the other side, nice and heavy weight. And these are perfect size for card making and for collage making. Here's one that has lots of words on there. So this is really fun. Peace and joy, my favorite things. It's the most wonderful time of the year. So we've got lots of um, Christmas songs and words on there. On the back side, you're getting another great, like a red flannel, so that's really fun. Remember, you're gonna get two of each. There are 12 designs. Beautiful, kind of a scuffed look on that. Realistic looking uh, fir boughs and berries there. And on the back, you get a nice stripe. It looks like that. So I love that he is, does such a nice job of combining the colors on these papers. Nice red dot, but all, all, always with that sort of vintage distressed look. So that's just beautiful. And on the back, another flannel in a black and white plaid. They're just beautiful to each of those. Another one with some nice reds. So the colors are really matching well. And here's another sheet of words. I'm going to have to turn that one around to look at it. And this is very similar to the other one, but this is a uh, black on white, and the other one was white on black. So you've got some uh, some things to choose from there, and a beautiful red with this beautiful large pattern there. So that's nice, and a matching uh, look on the other side. It's going to be these tiny little cross hatches. So beautiful. Gorgeous holly with that blue background and some nice red stripes to go with that. We're getting all the way through the 24 sheets and oh my gosh, a nice bright red flannel with uh, some beautiful, looks like a winter sweater pattern on the background. We have some green, like an olive green scuffed dots with a chevron pattern here on the back with all of the colors combining there. Really appreciate that, uh, that about Tim Holtz's papers. They are vintagey, they are matching, they are in some surprising looks sometimes, like this weather-worn kind of whitewashed wood, but it really goes with everything that he picks out so very well. And the last few that we have here are this beautiful sort of a teal blue snowflake look with some stars and green on the back. We'll go through two of those. And the last one is a piece that really could be cut up into little pieces and really start your collaging with that piece right there. Beautiful on that side. And oh, let's turn this around. And lots of little ticketed style numbers on the back. Very vintagey and fun. And it's going to be fun to combine those looks together. So those are the papers. And now we're going to get into what is called the Gilded Christmas Time Remnant Rubs. Now these are silver and gold foiling. You're seeing the gold foiling and there's a silver foiling. So you get two sheets of these and some beautiful um, sentiments and embellishments on there. Lots of different looks. And these are going to be great. They're going to work great on those papers, but they're also going to work great on cardstock or any other look. You could put these on scrapbook pages or on cards, but let me just show you how that works. You'll take these rubs, and so they have a piece of paper underneath. You're going to start by cutting out one of these pieces, and I'm going to just cut out, let's see, I'm going to peel this up just a little bit and cut out one word. I'm going to cut out the word wish and see how that looks. And we're just going to rub that on. And the, the rub-ons, the rub-on remnants, they're a little bit sticky on the back, so you're going to stick that right onto your paper like so. And they come with a little um, wood applicator like this, so popsicle stick. 
and you just start rubbing. And it should be very simple. You just want to make sure that you get it all the way across and you can see it sort of change color a little bit. It's sort of got a little textured looking so that when I lift it, and I'll, I'll lift it to check, I can see that it all moved on there. It, it transferred on. So really simple to do that. And you'll notice the white stayed on. It's just the gold that transferred. So you can do that with any of those. You've got um, two full sheets of those. One sheet of gold, one sheet of silver with lots and lots of fun um, uh, looks on there, upside down or not. And we also have these Tim Holtz Tidings design tapes. They match the papers really well. You've, you're going to get four rolls, one, two, three, four, and each roll is 10 yards. So this is very similar to washi tape, each with a different design. Two of these are glitter. So perfect with the papers. They're really going to stand out with those gold and silver remnant rubs. What a great new Christmas collection from Tim Holtz.